and if I create new record, or the record data is there. Okay, this is display method because brand is not there in the rental table. Brand is there in the car table. I am only selecting car ID, so I wanted to see even brand here. See, you can see the brand, right? If I select the brand, is showing. So I don't want to show here. I don't want to create a field. It has to show from the car table. Mileage also from the car table. But mileage, I am giving the option to the user to modify it by using edit method. So I am keeping it like now 12. Earlier it is on 10, right? If I change it here, it's automatically go and update here in the. I have to refresh this. Scan 12. Okay. So that's how yeah, yeah. display and edit methods works. But once we do that two methods, we have to do one thing, right? In the form level, we have to create, we have to update. Let me show you that quickly. Go to form level, go to rental table. We have already created a form. In the form, we will go to the design, right? In the design level, wherever we have the normal fields, we'll add in the grid. So there you have to add your controls, unbound controls. Bound controls in the sense they are they are tied up with the data database and field database field. Unbound control it will not tied up with the database and fields. So if you see you have to create car brand string. Right click and take the string control. Once you take the string control, you have to change the name. Go to properties and you have to set the data source. What is the data source? From which table we would like to assign the display method? From rental table. Because here also you're using rental table. Assign the data source, which is there in your data source. Then you can assign the data method. Data method is nothing but display method or edit methods. Okay. So if you drop, if you click this drop down, you can see all the data methods which, you, which are there in the table level. This is very slow. So you can see all the methods. There are uh, four methods, but you can see like model. This is model and this is the brand. Second one is the brand. This is the brand. OK, brand I have assigned. The third one is mileage. For mileage, it is a real value, so I have taken the real control. You have to select the real control and change the name. Go to properties and select the data source, rental table, and assign the data method is mileage method. So that's all. Your work is done and build your uh, form. You can open and apply. You can open and see the data. Okay, so for applying these values into the form, we need to create unbound controls and assign these methods to them. Uh, unbound controls. Yeah, that's what I'm telling. Yeah. Okay, fine. Clear, right? Yeah, yeah. Perfect. 